Okay, um, today on today's call, we got Andy Styles, one of my clients uh, who's been through the LRVO marketing promotional formula with me, and I uh, just want to do a testimonial video about the uh, big results and, and breakthrough business that, that we've seen through uh, Andy's, Andy's business from the LRVO program. So, Andy, if you can, just to get started, I mean, will you tell everybody a little bit, you know, about yourself, your bar, um, um, where you're located? Uh, and maybe the concept of your bar? Sure. Um, my name is Andy Styles. I own Styles Public House. Um, it's a pub that's more of an American style pub. Um, has a cocktail list. Um, been there for three years. It's in an area called the Old Market in Omaha, uh, where it's basically 30 bars and restaurants in a very, uh, like, four block area. Okay. That's where so it's very, you know, a lot of people bouncing around, just walking around and going far to Um Which, let's see, what else can you really be? Well, that, no, that, that that's pretty good. I mean, I just we just want to get a general idea so the viewers kind of know, uh, you know, what what kind of place you have. So I think that's good. But, uh, you know, before we started working together, uh, what kind of marketing did you do? And you know, did it work? Was it profitable? Was it non-profitable? Um, we, let's see. I started out with right off the bat, I did some radio ads and they did a little bit of work for me. Yeah. But extremely expensive. Um, just to get even some kind of money out of it, you're gonna have to spend a good two to four thousand dollars just to try and get some real serious airtime. Right. Um, which you might get that back, you might not. Um, see so yeah, I've done some Facebook marketing but I didn't really do very I didn't really know how to do it correctly. I was really targeting very well. Um, just some paper ads that did absolutely nothing. Yeah. And yet again, was expensive. It made no sense to do it, so I stopped doing that. Um, trying to think of what I was going to do. Threw flyers out, try all kinds of stuff. Right. Oh, oh, okay. Sounds good. Yeah. I just wanted to get a general idea. Um, and, you know, about probably about a month ago, three weeks ago, you know, I just wanted to kind of see how the results were going. I mean, we saw your list um, obviously growing and, and the mailers and everything going out, um, emails going out, and I wanted to see how business was going. You reported back, and this is really why I wanted to do this video right away, was, you know, you had mentioned that your sales had increased by 25%. You saw more customers in the door. So can you kind of give like a brief overview of, you know, we've been working together three, four months and, and you've seen these increases and, um, you know, give us a little brief overview of kind of the, the positives that you've seen from working with me and, and implementing this LRVO uh, marketing promotional formula. Oh, sure. Uh, let's see. I think. It has brought in more people to be, to be more frequent to be coming in. Uh -huh. And there's all people that you know, have not ever heard of my bar that are now coming in because it's, they've now seen, seen the ads. They you know, have interest in the deal, want to know what it's about. Um, I, sometimes they'll even walk in and I'll show them my little paperwork from the walls and say, you know, you know up for this. It's, it's a real deal. You read about it. And they think I'm crazy. but. Um, they just seem to love it. It's bring, bringing more people in earlier on in the night, which I only sell booze. I don't sell any food. Uh -huh. um, so my, my night game is basically get people in there as early as possible and have them stay as late as possible. Right. That, that's been, I've been doing fine, but it's increased people coming in more frequently. Oh. Uh, okay. And and one of the things that, that works so well that I try to preach to uh, you know, whether if they're clients of mine or non-clients of mine, but is you need to be extremely personal within your marketing. And we always, you know, my, my strategy is let's get them in with a lead magnet. Let, let's capture their information by providing some kind of offer where we break even on the front end, but we get that information where we're going to make all that money on the back end and we put them through that new customer to loyal customer marketing system. And I always hear from my clients that they get uh, replies back or emails back or even thank you <laughs> letters in the mail from these customers that you're mailing to. I mean, are, are you seeing anything like that at all from people recognizing the difference in the marketing compared to what everybody else is doing in your area? Yes. Um, in fact, I've had a lot of my competitors start funding me on Facebook and uh, following me on Twitter more because then you want to know what's going on, why I'm doing what I'm doing. Uh, but yeah, I've gotten a lot of thank you replies, um, 
the surveys that, that are being sent out, I'm getting a lot of replies off of those, I'm getting a lot of good ideas off of them too. Um, okay. Well, <laughs> no, that, that that's good. Um, is, is there anything else that you want to add? I mean, the reason why I'm doing these videos right now is I don't have time to work with as many clients as I would like. I'm turning people down. Um, there's some people who just can't afford the monthly services. Um, so now I'm, I'm creating an online platform where all the templates, everything, pretty much of what I've done with you, all my past clients, I can provide them to an online learning center where all the emails are done for them, um, the flyers, everything is websites, everything's done for them. They just need to, you know, get the ambition to kind of put that self or put that to work with either themselves or or have their managers to do it. So I mean, would you recommend this? to other bars, restaurants, and you know, what do you really like the most out of this whole process? It was, it was a little bit of footwork right at the beginning, but it was actually a lot easier than I expected it to be. To be. Um, and for the people that are, you know, said that they can't afford the deal or however, that's going on. If they're doing radio or paper ads, stop it. There's, there's no reason to do that. It's, it's, this works far better than anything else. Okay. Okay. Well, I, I appreciate it, Andy. Um, thanks for being on the call, and uh, you know, we'll talk to you here uh, in the next coming days.